Alright guys, welcome back to yet another episode of our Pokemon Black 2 Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, if you didn't get to go see it yet, I highly suggest you go check that out. We went and we defeated Skyla in the, um, 6th gym badge. And we were able to get that, and then we also had a grinding montage at the beginning and leveled everybody up. And nothing has really changed in terms of our, um, team party or anything like that, but let's just go over it anyways. Um... Starting off, we've got our Adamant Shell Shock holding the Luck Incense with Protect, Surf, Bite, and Aqua Tail. Then we've got, as always, our Rock and Prime Time, the Dialga, with Earth Power, Aura Sphere, Power Gem, and Iron Tail. Then we've got Jean, the Mrs. Mime, with Psybeam, Meditate, Psychic, and Mimic holding the Psychic Gem. We have our Adamant Haxorus Splicer. With the Lucky Egg, Rock and Dragon Dance, Dragon and Claw, Slash and False Swipe. Then we've got our Modest Natured Cacturn, Mr. Free Hugs, with the Experience Share, Rock and Leech Seed, Fin Attack, Pin Missile, and Sucker Punch. So, in this episode, we are going to tackle out Reverse Mountain. And then, hopefully, we will also be able to do the Strange House and maybe get into Undilla Town. That's kind of like my goal for today, is to do that. But we also get an encounter! Ooh, this music. <gasps> Ooh, Regice. <laughs> we can get a Regice, and we can get Lugia. But I don't... I, I don't want to keep catching Legendaries. Like, I'm trying not... I, I'm only using Primetime because of the fact that we were... He got... We, it was the starter. That's the starter. Um, so, Wild Legendaries, I'm actually going to try not to catch. Um... So yeah, we're not gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna catch this. I'm gonna run away from it. Um, we do have that token though. So um, if we do, we can always go back. If we decide that we do want a, uh, a Pokemon, we can always go back and uh, come back here, or we can go back to Route Seven and try to catch that Lugia if we ever wanted to, or get the Chimchar. So, oh, really, a Zigzagoon? Wow, okay, that's a bad randomization. But just, um, I don't really have a choice. So, with that, um, yeah, we're gonna go do the Strange House first, though, actually. But anyways, back to what I was saying, because I'm kind of just going all over the place. Oops, sorry about the mic. We have, um, <clears throat> different Pokemon we can fight. We stole that token. So if we ever f come across anything that we see in the wild, we can run away from it and go, okay, I'm using the token to go ahead and get another encounter here and go black. And then hopefully we don't run into a legendary. Well, I'm also going to make that, I'm going to make something up. So that way right now, just, just to prevent that as, oh crap, second biker. Um, if we do use the token and it comes up with another legendary, I'm not, the token's not going to be wasted because I'm kind of avoiding the legendaries on purpose, so to speak. Unless I specifically state, like, okay, I'm using the token to try to find blank, or something like that, I don't know. No. No, I can't do that. That's that's too... That makes it too easy for us. So, I'm actually... Yeah, you know what? We just have the second token. If I choose to use the token and we run into a legendary, I can either choose to catch it or not, and uh, it'll probably just be power in the PC. But I'm trying to save the Master Ball and stuff for when we run into Cobalion, or Virizion, or Terrakion, or Kyurem, for that matter. But I think Kyurem is um, static. I think he's. Uh, I don't think we can change him because of the fact that it's a course thing where you have to fuse the two together. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna stay the same. I'm pretty sure he's not gonna get changed. Um, but we'll see. <laughs> Scun tank. Growth. Yeah, here. All right, so now we have the strange house, which I think there was a TM over here last I checked. It was, but instead of it being shadow ball, we get shadow claw. Ooh, that's actually that's gonna come in handy. Mm, 
Okay, so... Oh, it's this house. There's a Pokemon in here. Okay, it's a Vanillish. I'm not upset with that. A Vanillish is cool. A van you know, an Ice type and a Vanillish is not bad. Turns into uh, Vanillux, so... I'm, I'm down with the Vanillish. It's got a 120 capture rate, so it's going to be pretty dang good to catch. Or is it higher? Yeah, no, it's easy. It's easier to catch. Um, at 47, it becomes Vanilla Lux, but it's at level 31, which means that it's going to have. It doesn't have Ice Beam yet. That it learns at 36, which is totally cool with me. Uh, but it's going to have most likely uh, either Icy Wind or Avalanche. I'm going to guess that it's probably only keeping the past four moves previously. Which means it's going to have Mirror Shot, Taunt, Avalanche, and Acid Armor. So, it looks like we're still in the best bet to stay on uh, Shell Shock here and just go for Bite and hope for the best. Does exactly half, so now we'll just chuck a Great Ball at it. Yeah, we'll chuck a Great Ball at it, see what happens. Should be able to catch this thing at a great ball, I think. One, dos, son. Nope. Darn it. Okay, well, let's check it. Let's just check it. We'll just check an ultra ball at this thing, and the ultra ball should allow it to get caught for sure. Uh, Pokeball. There we go. Great ball. Ultra ball. Not great ball. That's an ultra. Dink. Uno, dos, tres. Chicken. Cool, we got a female for finally another female besides Jean. Vanillish. Three particles. You know, I think it's actually kind of cool. Um, I'm going to put my mouse here. But this part right here, the face that you're seeing, is actually a trick. Its eyes are actually right here. Like, and its mouth, I think, is like right. It's hidden underneath the little snow cone thing. Like, so this whole like cuddly exterior thing, it make, it's, a, it's a trick that you're going to look. So it's, you're not actually staring at it. And it's actually going to come out. So, like, the hands are actually kind of like its horns, so to speak. So, the whole top half from, like, right here and up is just a whole fake thing, which I kind of find really cool. It's a trick. It's a predator, a predatory tactic. <sighs> we'll go, uh... We're going to name this Vanilla Ice. Oh, it fits. Yay. Alright, Vanilla Ice. Cool. Now, was I right about the moveset? Ooh, what's it holding? An Absorb Bulb. Huh. Okay. Avalanche, Taunt, Mirror Shot, and Acid Armor. I was right. <laughs> okay. So that's not a bad Pokemon. Uh, let's do. Where are we at? Reverse amount? No, you need. Strange House. That's what we're doing. We're doing Strange House first. Please tell me I reset my timer. I probably didn't. Again. I didn't. Because I'm an idiot. Alright. Um. As you can tell, I keep trying to make these videos not 30 minutes, and every time I try, it ends up being 30 minutes. <laughs> so, um, okay, so first thing to do is to enter the basement. There's a staircase on the left side of the ground. Yeah, right down here. Cool. I think a spell tag supposedly could be found in here. I think this is probably that one. We get another honey. Ew. Okay. 
Ooh, another item, but we can't get to it right now. And, uh, oh, a frost last. That would have been cool, too, having a frost last, but that's alright. I like vanillish. We're gonna run. Um, oh, can't wake up. Can't run away, okay. Leave me alone. Do I really have to body you? Okay, fine. I will destroy you. This thing's annoying. Go away. Ow! You fucking shit! Go away! Ass! Super pill, go away! You're injuring me with the crap. It's not cool, man. Exactly 80 points. Alright, so now we can get out of here. For right now. <sighs> and up the stairs. Two doors on the ground floor will now be open on the left and the right side of the staircase to the second floor. A trainer can be found inside of the right room. Well, we don't want the right room. We want the left room. Oh, I lied. We go in here. Walk up the stairs on the right side to reach the second floor. Walk to the left side and down the staircase. Into the door. Okay, so now we go up. We can't... Oh, wait. So we have to go in. Okay. We go in. I didn't want to fight him. But we don't have a choice. Darn it. Oh well. So he's only got level 36s, so we're still okay, I think. Backpacker and sent out Porygon Z. Of course he does! Let's see, Sinnoh. Yeah, that's got download. So it's 36, which means he's got Embargo, Signal Beam, Magnet Rise, maybe Discharge. So really nothing super scary though. So I'm just going to surf this thing. Embargo, okay. Can't use items on him anymore, which is still fine. Form. Pathetic. Pathetic. So there's that. Um, what lived? What the heck? That's interesting. That's right, we get the Lunar Wing. We can find, um, either Cresselia or Darkrai here. Totally forgot about that. That's cool. Um, okay. Still blocked, so now we walk up. Oh! That makes sense. Now walk up the stairs on the right side. That's right, the little girl. The ghost girl. Mom, um, Abra, where are you? Oh, that's right, this part saddens me all the time because it's so sad. Let me come back down here. Yes, she's another super repel. Around the chairs. On top. 
I should be able to. No. There we go. There it is. Super potion that used to be a dust stone. It's alright. And then we come this way. The dark dream heard my dad's voice. Forget about the lunar wing. Please stay here with me. Oh. This used to be her bedroom. Oh. Found the lunar wing. I can't take it now, but it'll be okay. Please return the wing to the Pokemon. I was waiting on the bridge so I could return it myself. So she did die. Once you exit the room, the doors to the other rooms on the second floor will be accessible. The room on the left holds a trainer. The room on the right holds a rare candy. We'll go to the room on the right first. How is she heard your father's voice in your nightmares before I enter the room? Continue the lunar ring. She'll ask you to forget about it and stay in the house there. Upon picking up the wing, she will appear behind you once more and tell you a bit about how she waited to give it back to the Pokemon that once held it. Uh, that's really it. So... Um, yep, that's sad. That was kind of depressing. Alright, so this is the rare candy, but we got a repeat ball instead. Which isn't exactly a bad thing, but we don't want to catch duplicates, so I guess it sort of is a bad thing. Alright, well, that's pretty much it for the strange house, so we're going to leave now and start into Reverse Mountain and head towards under the town, so... Here we go! I'm actually debating to go pick up some more, um, super repels real quick. Actually, I am going to do that. Because of the fact that we're going to run out. I have a feeling we're going to run out heavily inside of Reversal Mountain. Bye. And we have a ton of money now, so... Super Repel. Twenty-two. Spend 11,000. Okay. There we go. So now we have 30 Super Repels. That oh, should be plenty. Yeah, should be plenty. Um, we're running low on potions too. We ever get trapped? I need to buy potions. I should buy some. Uh, buy ten of these, just in case. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. All right, reversal mountain. Tiny mushroom. Dun, 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 dun. Yes, use the super repel because we don't want any other Pokemons. All right, so strange house is completed. Now we've got the inside of this. All right, so now we got Bianca. So, really, we don't have to do shit. We can just literally aim to go east, because the rest of it's all battles. So I'm not going to worry about it. We're just going to head east. I'm not going to worry about going south and dealing with all that crap. 
we still get seen. Well, it makes sense that it'd be a double battle, though, so... There we go. Double battle with Bianca, who hopefully will not attack me. I hope. Ursaring and Curlia. Ooh. She has Machamp and Shellshock. That's awesome. Now we got Torrent, so we're going to bite the Curlia. Om nom. Okay, Curlia goes down. Submission misses. He goes for Slash. That did a lot of damage. Um, yeah, we're surfing. Getting rid of this Larvesta, and sorry, Machamp. But you sped blood. So, down goes the Larvesta. Slash on the Machamp. Final throw. Good, he, he didn't attack me. <laughs> Good. Piss me off. Sent out Goldeen. Okay, well that makes that easy. Now we do not want to protect. I'm going to just smack the Goldie and bite it. Om nom 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 nom. Submission works. Dun 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 dun. Okay. Done and done. And we have another double battle, I think, because we can't escape. Nope. Okay. Another double battle. Dun, 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 dun. Beach. Oh my god, that Drapion. Okay, I'm taking that thing out first because that thing is scary. That thing is super scary, as you can see why. That thing is faster than fast, man. Do have my surf didn't do jack. Oh, jeez, not good. Yeah, submission the Drapion. There you go. All right, surfing again. Poison jab the Machamp. Ow. Venom shock the Machamp. Dude, they're ganging up on poor Machamp. The Surf's probably gonna kill him. Nope, lift by five, but the Drapion's gone. Thank Joyce. And so is the Beedrill. Cool, Dunzo Funzo. But Machamp dies to recoil. Bummer. Puchina. Piece of cake. And Ooxie. Not so much piece of cake. Max sent out Aaron. <laughs> Poor Bianca got renamed to Max. She's gonna put the Aaron to sleep. Iron Tail the Puchina. She should probably bop it for sure. Um. Aqua Tail is oopsie. It's using Future Sight. That's scary. God, dude, nothing is damaging this thing. Alright, doesn't matter though, because oopsie goes down. You foresaw an attack, but it doesn't matter because that battle doesn't last long enough. Ha! Ah! Free hugs, crew to 43, yay, free hugs. Okay, now we've got a doctor. Um, actually, oh wait, I've been using Shell Shock a lot, so. using him. I, I was like, I want to switch the Splicer, but... Mm. 
next way out. We're already done. Oh, wow. We are. We're done. Cool. She's gonna... <laughs> Thanks for helping me through it. But I'm gonna go search for Heatran now. What? Okay. Undala Town. And we made it. This is Undala Town. Okay. Where's the Pokemon Center? Oh. Okay. Cool. Awesome. We've made it to Undala Town. And I think we, since we can surf, we have enough time for uh, an encounter as well. Which is good. It's always good to have encounters. Okay. So let's surf. Let's see what we can find in Undala Town. Just need to hit the end of the page here. Oh, yeah. Oh. Strange house. It's funny that the strange house is technically first before anything else, which is weird. Um, Alright, so another town. We have Undela Bay as well. There are five different areas that all connect to Undela Town. The west is Reversal Mountain, the north is Route 13, east is Undela Bay, and south is Route 14, and then of course there is the Marine Tube which connects us to Humalaw City after we obtain the 7th Gym Badge in uh, Opelousid City. So, with that in mind, we are going to get the encounter here in Undela Town, which is a... Ampharos! Oh, it's Chief! Okay, I want to catch this. I actually, I really want to catch this. Um, we're gonna switch though. I'll switch to free hugs. Just electro ball. Let's see what happens. Oh, she dodged. Actually, pin miss is probably not the best attack to use. Now that I think about it. But I actually I want to test something first, so let's test out. Empress's catch rate is still really high, so let's just chuck an ultra ball at it, see what happens. One, two, three. No. Nope. Worth a shot. Um, let's go faint attack, see what happens. I mean, I could have sucker punched this thing, but... Please don't crit, 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 please don't die, please don't die. Oh, thank god, okay. <laughs> now we should catch this thing for sure. Wow, really? Come on. There we go. Woo! Okay, so we got Ampharos, and I'm gonna use the name that Luke always uses. I'm gonna name it Chief. Just because, well, and actually, nah, I'm not gonna copy. I already took one name from Shady Penguin, so actually, we'll just do, we'll do it. Uh, uh, I want to say Jasmine and uh, Jodo get names for Ampharos, Amphi. So we'll go Amphi. No, Amphi, why are you in the dead box? No, come back. You're not supposed to be in the dead box. You're alive. Let me get you out of there. You're not dead. Who is alive? 
Alright, so we have Amphi the Ampharos in the PC box now. So, with that in mind, if you guys enjoyed this episode, give it some thumbs up. If you hated it, put some thumbs down. If, uh, you know, you guys are excited to see where we're going with this, because we do have Under the Bay's Encounter, Route 14's Encounter, Route 13's Encounter, Human Lab City, eventually, after the route, and then we've got Route 9, and uh, Route 12, and Village Bridge, and Lake Unosa. We've got a lot of places left to go, and a lot of encounters left to get. So there is a lot of stuff left to do, and this is going to be some fun. So, with that in mind, I'm going to quit a babbling. You guys have an awesome day. Be kind to one another. I will see you in the next video.